Guys, one thing about preparing for survival is even in an everyday situation, uh, you can be out hiking or camping and you can have an accident, you can rip your clothes, your pack can break, you know, buckles can snap. I mean, there's a lot of different things. Even in your car, you can have situations that are just everyday. And one thing that we overlook a lot is how to repair things. And so recently, Exotac came out with the rip spool. And this is just an aluminum container. It contains some items to be able to do repairs. And, you know, Exotac is really innovative to me. I mean, they have some of the coolest products. They're not the cheapest on the block, but they're made in the USA and they're very innovative. Now, it's an aluminum cylinder. It comes in different colors. You can check the Exotac website. Uh, this is the Blaze Orange, and I believe it comes in black. It comes in gunmetal and OD. Uh, and then here on the end, Exotac. And then we have Made in the USA. There's 50 inches of duct tape wrapped around here, which is usually something that's kind of a pain. Now you can wrap that around a credit card for sure, but this gives you a nice roll of duct tape. And then we have braided monofilament line, which is really strong and it goes all the way around. There's 60 feet of that. And uh, right now it's sealed. We're gonna break this open and take a look at it. There is a small little hole right here in the top where you can braid that through and then you can use it and, and reel it off. Now this twists off and here on the inside we have a needle. Now I think this is pretty ingenious and uh, there's a stopper in here so it actually kind of fits and puts some pressure on the needle. And so this keeps it really secure, keeps you from sticking yourself. And this is a number 16 sail needle. And so it's really sturdy, plenty wide enough to be able to get your braided uh, line in there. And you know, you can do a lot of things. I mean, this is probably about a medium sized needle where you can get, you know, smaller repairs, packs, canvas, webbing, things like that. And that to me is really a good size. And it fits right back down in here and then just bring it, close it up. Now you'll notice there is an O-ring gasket. So this is waterproof and it's gonna keep this sealed. And it just locks down really tight and nice. A really compact little system. And then we have, of course, the fire cord. And this is a little keeper here that we can pop open. We're gonna look at that in just a minute. But this just gives you a little something to be able to grab hold of. Now the duct tape's cut to a certain way to where it is easy to find. You just peel this back. And again, it's about 50 inches, uh, in which that's about four feet. So that gives you plenty of duct tape. And again, it keeps it in a really small package. And then when we're finished, we can roll it back up or we can replace it easy enough when you have to use it. Now for me, having a little compartment in here and a small needle, why not throw some more items in here? So this doesn't come with it, but this is real simple to do. A couple of safety pins is definitely something for repair. And then we have the monofilament line, so why not throw in a couple of really small hooks and a couple of sinkers. And so I've fit all that in here and gotten it closed with no problem. So that's definitely something to me that was a good addition, and yet, you know, it's not, it's real easy to do. Now one thing that's real simple to do that'll give you some advantage is to magnetize the needle. You can run this over a magnet a number of times, magnetize it, and that way you can use this if you need to build a compass. I mean, that is a natural compass. Take a leaf, put it on water, and it'll point to true north. So that's definitely an advantage here. Now one thing I like too is I can take the end of the needle, put it here, and I can push in with this little handle. And so that way, if I need to push through, I can push through this way. I don't have to worry about that needle sliding into my hand. Why not have fire cord over paracord? Great for fire starting. Take and just pop open your little tab here. You can pull the paracord out or the fire cord. And again, this can be replaced. So if you need to use it, you can always go back. Now right inside here is your fire cord, it's red. Go ahead and just pull that out some, just like this. And then we want to go ahead and fray it. It's just going to help it to light. It feels like it's got a kind of a wax jute feel to it. But we're just going to go ahead and start it. There you go. Now you have fire starting capability. Now I went ahead and unrolled all the duct tape. And it's around seven feet long. So that's a lot longer than just 50 inches. And here you can see the rip spool without the duct tape. And I'm sure that the monofilament line taking it off, that would be the same. Good high quality piece and uh, it's gonna be very secure. And again, guys, I can just take and put a fresh roll of duct tape on here with no problem.
One thing too I want to point out is that there is a roll pin in here to hold your lanyard in place. And so that's going to be really super secure and they just fit it into that one side. Now the Exotac ripstop is $29.95, which is a fairly high price, but yet for all the features you're getting for the aluminum cylinder that's machined and the way this thing is watertight, you have a place again to put your uh, duct tape, you have a place again to put your braided nylon monofilament line, and it just makes it a really good package, and then again you have your fire cord. And so this is a really good way to be able to slip a small repair kit in your bag. And all these things can be refilled if you ever need to use it. So guys, check out Exotac. They have some of the best fire starters, ferrocium rods, nano strikers. I mean, they have a lot of different type of fire starting gear that is really, again, so innovative. And they have other products too that are just great for EDC and for survival. Can you go cheaper? Sure. Take a credit card, wrap around your duct tape, throw in some monofilament line on a little spool and a needle. Just don't stick yourself and you're fine but this gives you a very compact organized package and to me i think it's worth the money and i appreciate exotac for sending this this is not a paid endorsement i just like exotac products and again made down in georgia usa guys when it comes to prepping and survival there's a lot of different information out on the web and it takes a lot to try to find and source what's credible and what's not one of the best sources that i know is survival dispatch insider they use some of the top names in the survival community that come together and it is really just a, one of the best resources on the web we upload one video that is exclusive to the insider every week and we're just glad to be a part uh, i'm going to have a link down below in the description uh, I think it's well worth checking out. Be strong, be of good courage. God bless America. Long live the Republic. Uh, this actually, there is duct tape, 50, there's 50, Guys, when it comes to survival, one thing that is, guys, when it comes to survival, whether it's just a, guys, one thing about, be strong, be of good courage. <clears throat>